Hello and welcome back to Tori's Craft. As always, it's Tori. Okay, so I got an unboxing. Actually, it's kind of is already unboxed, um, but I'm not showing you guys the image yet. It is a three-panel um, kit. So there's three of them. Now I got this off of Amazon, and let me double check the price. Um, ba -ba -ba -ba. It's $39.99 uh, for this. I don't know how much I paid for it, but it's $39.99 right now. So I'm going to go ahead and flip it all over. And let's see. Oops. Okay, it's not cooperating with me. There we go. So it's Peacock's. Um, so this is panel, uh, the panel number one, and it's a partial, which is fine. Partial's okay. I've got to fix this, because it is kind of a little bumpy, and I don't like bumps on my canvases, especially when it's got stuff going on. And I bought this a while back ago. I just haven't done the unboxing for it. And I figured, you know, yeah, I'm coming back from my break. I might as well just do this real fast. I've got a lot of videos to catch up on anyway. So this is panel number one. Let's see if I can do this. Ba boom this is the middle panel i'm trying to get y'all to see the top portion of it so it's really beautiful i personally love having multiple panels uh, just because you can put them together and either in like one frame have like a massive frame I mean that's going to be a lot of money at the end of the day because that frame is going to be expensive oh I've got sneeze coming on hold on <coughs> it is spring or actually summertime here in Oklahoma but anyway, so that's the middle panel. And last but not least, the last panel. So this, <coughs> oh, Maya, she does this. She's like, Sissy's doing a video. I've got to bark. But okay, this is the um, last panel, the third panel. And just look how gorgeous. It's going to be even more gorgeous once the um, drills are on there. But this one comes straight from Amazon. And I just, I'm, I'm loving it. I'm loving the canvas. I'm loving it. I'm loving it all. But there was another one that I'm missing now. I say I'm missing it. I don't know where it's at. This can't because I went through all my stuff. Who knows? I, I'll we'll see. It's been a minute. I ordered this back on uh, March 29th so but um, the two peacocks are looking away from the middle canvas so of course you got toolkit 
and your drills, which are all numbered, which makes it very easy. And I'm going to have to put it all back in this bag because this bag is labeled um, with the... I'm going to just turn this sideways. The bag is labeled with the kit, um, the kit's number. So the drills are not. So they all have to go back in this bag. Because otherwise, I'm going to lose them. And if I lose them, I'm going to lose my crap. So, and this is the only bag that I have. So, these are all the drills that's associated with this entire piece. So, we have our number ones. There's 20 drills. We have two, number three. So this is a yellow, a white, here's a blue. Number four, and they're kind of having a DMC theme as well because when I'm looking on here, um, they have these DMC numbers but these are rhinestones and I don't know the people who made this kit and I don't know if I'm gonna ever purchase from them again but I probably will keep them so number four so this is kind of a dark blue and this is a light blue um, See, make sure I'm in the camera frame. Um, number five, uh, which is kind of a green, like a seafoam green. Number six is a more of a yellow. Number seven is your special big drill. Um, number eight is gold drills. Oh, that's really pretty. Those are gold, and that was my uh, Nova. Sorry about that. They're playing in the background. Um, here's number nine, um, another big special drill. Number 10, these are special drills as well. They're little purple teardrop drills. Um, number 11 looks like little um, regular DMC drills, but they're very, they're tinier than normal drills. I want to say number 12 also tiny drills number 13 look really pretty colors here's number 14 here's number 15 am I still in the frame okay number 16 number 17 I picked up 18 I'm like wait where's number 17 um, here's number 18 number 19 and number 20 I'm hoping you guys can all see that um, but that's really you know amazing output um, I'm definitely really sure that I'm not gonna run out of any drills because some of these drills are like well some some of these drills some of these bags are like packed so i don't think i'm gonna run out anytime soon i'm definitely gonna have some extras i can't really wait to do this one it's gonna be really pretty uh, i love peacocks i really do peacocks are my thing i um there when my mom was working at a company she was a case manager or she was a case manager and a DMC um, manager something she she worked at this company for like ever and a day but um, when she was working there they moved buildings and there was some wild peacocks 
and I would go and take pictures any chance I got that um, they there were um, peacock feathers laying around and so they shed their peacock feathers like their little tail feathers were shed and stuff like that so I started to gather them up and uh, one day I got very lucky there's um, on the males in particular um, on the top of their head it looks like um, it's like really weird it's kind of hard to describe but these little feathers kind of reminds me of like a little shield um, that they would don on their head it would make them a little bit festive but um, it's kind of like this on top of their, um, this head on this peacock's head I found that one day and I think I still have it actually it's a bit dusty but this is the feather I'm, I'm describing if you guys can see that it's really small but that's on top of their head and I absolutely love peacocks so and they can fly too I've seen one up in the tree um, so it's amazing what these birds can do so let's see but I just found this one lying on the ground it still has its colors to it even to this day um, it's very beautiful I mean on camera it doesn't do it any justice but I mean it's very beautiful I keep it close by um, just because it's become one of my um, lucky totems I guess you can say like finding a four-leaf clover or something like that it's become very lucky to me um, so I keep it close by and I just I absolutely love it um, but I wish I can go back to that company's location again and just collect more tail feathers and just chill and be out in nature again um, it was really fun over there and hanging out with the peacocks um, of course you know they would never come up to you because they were wild um, but still being able to be around them and having that much fun that was a blessing Alrighty, so that's going to be it for this one. Um, sorry, I was trying to find a safe place to put the drills. Um, so yeah, this is going to be it for this video. If you guys liked it, go ahead and give me a shout out. And... I hope to see you guys um, some more later on. Um, maybe, who knows what's going to happen with this one. So, I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye for now.